Hi everyone, this is Hernan from Seagate, and today we're visiting our NAS partner, Asset Store. And we have David with us, marketing manager, he's going to talk to us a little bit about their NAS products, uh, about some of the features and functions and what they do, and um, some really cool new stuff. So, David, so tell us a little bit about yourself and your company. Um, so, I'm from a suit store and our, co our company was founded in 2011. Um, the name we came up with, a suit store, was because we use the name Asus and Storage. And so, putting it up together, we kind of came up with a suit store. Um, so, we are a subsidiary of Asus, and so that's our pretty much our parent company. Cool. And that's kind of like the background of our, our, our company. Awesome. Fantastic. Really good story. So, tell us a little bit um, about this NAS here. Um, what's its model number um, and what do we got? Alright, so this is our uh, one of our new NAS models, AS4004T. Um, and this main feature on this NAS is the 10 gigabyte Ethernet, um, which is built in. Uh, compared to uh, all the other NAS models that we have, this is the one. This is the only one that we have that's 10 gig right now. So this is it here. So, see the interface here, we have, what is this first one? So the first one we have is a USB 3.0. Okay. Um, and, then, and then the next one is the 10 gig Ethernet port right here. Okay. And then the next two are the one gigabyte Ethernet. Got it, okay, awesome, great, great. And how's the installation? Uh, how do we, do we need tools? What do we need to install um, um, to install Seagate hard drives in this thing? All right, so the cool thing about this NAS is that uh, this is our first model that we have uh, that's toolless installation. So you don't need any screwdrivers, you don't need any hammers or anything anymore. Um, all you got to do is you just pop off these uh, side hinges and uh, these hinges will hold on to the, the hard drive. Oh, wow. Check that out. So the yeah. That's awesome. Very easy installation easy. now. Yeah. Good, good. So no tools. No more to needed. That's great. I love it. I love it. So tell us a little bit more. Um, who is this? What do you guys? Who, who's the customer for this? Who would use a, a NAS like this? Um, what kind of customer? Are you um, guys mainly doing? photographers, small business, medium-sized business, anybody that can use storage. Okay. Um, any kind of storage, and mainly now it's like everybody's trying to store stuff online. Definitely. Um, but they also want something that's private in their home that they have physical access to. Right. So this is right. pretty much uh, the main purpose of the NAS. Good, good. And so, what happens if? Like me, I travel a lot. So if I need to access information or data on the road, how would I do that? Is there, do you guys have something, an app or something I can use? Yeah, we actually have, we actually have eight apps. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, eight apps. And uh, the apps are mainly, each app has its own function. So like AI photo would be mainly for photo. Nice. Uh, AI data, mainly you can log on to your NAS with your phone to access your data, like Excel, PowerPoint, whatever, wow. Word. Um, and we have AI Secure, that's for your surveillance, and those pretty much are, like, we have, we have apps that will cover everything. Cool, awesome, awesome. <clears throat> you mentioned surveillance. So you can, via network, you can connect cameras to this. Yes. Um, does it have a maximum amount of cameras uh, that you can, that can connect on the network and that can record? Is there a maximum? So, um, so for surveillance, mm -hmm. um, all our NAS models come with four free IP camera license. Um, and the lower end models, like the, the, one, the 10 series, mm -hmm. um, the, the 31, 32 series, they probably have, they have a maximum of like 16 cameras. Okay. Um, but if you, get, if you get up to the 60 series and the 70 series, you can have a maximum of 64 cameras. Oh, wow. yeah. that's, right. that's really good. And you can access video, all your videos. Stuff all like of that. it on, on your app, um, or you can access it through your- Live, like you can see actually live, people at live, your doorstep. Yes. Yeah. Okay, well, that's really good. I love it. That's a really good feature. So tell me, what else do you guys have um, that uh, makes your makes your guys is unique? Um, makes your NAS uh, unique. Tell us. Um, so we have a uh, a few s software features that are pretty unique to us, and um, so one of them is called Easy Connect. Um, and with the NAS, a lot of times um, people will uh, set up their NAS and they decide to go out maybe to another. Uh, another computer, mm -hmm. um, but they need to download a software to, to actually connect to their NAS. Right. Uh, with our Easy Connect, um, all you gotta do is go to our website called easyconnect.to. Mm -hmm. From there, you just type in your cloud ID, and you can type in your password, and you log in directly to your NAS from any computer without downloading any software. 
Oh wow! So you can be in a library. You can be anywhere. Yep. The you can bring your laptop anywhere as long as you have a hotspot. You can connect to it, or you can be in the library, like you said, um, connect to it. To and the it's secure. I mean, is it is it safe to access to be able to do that anywhere? Yes, and it's it's all secured up through HTTPS. Oh wow! Okay, good, 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 really good. Okay, so so what else? What else do you guys have um, about your NAS system? I know we it, obviously it's got 10 gig, so that's uh, it's blazing speed. It's it's fast. It's great. Um, we know about the storage, so this is a four-bay system. So with the Seagate, I mean, you can add 14 terabytes times four. Yeah. So we know it's it's very it's it's capacity and storage is robust. Mm -hmm. It's obviously it's network throughput is robust with a 10 gig. Mm -hmm. So like you said, it's great for photographers or anybody that has larger files that you're right. dragging and dropping. Right. Good for small offices and medium-sized offices that are that are backing up. So what does someone do to back up? Because we know it's a centralized storage system, right? right? Obviously. And then, so can they work with other apps and other other software that they can back up with? Or maybe they already have stuff, um, you know, that's built into their systems. Mm -hmm. Can they still use uh, your NAS? Yes. So um, the way we back up is we have a software and we, we're just going to try to back up things from your computer. We have a software called uh, so we start uh, backup, okay. and that uh, software is mainly used just to back up you know, continuously. Mm -hmm. Whether you decide to do synchronization, which is like uh, whatever files change, that's what gets backed up, okay. or you do some sort of um, setup where it's like daily or weekly backup, yep. and that automatically on your computer will um, back up the files that you've chosen or the folders that you've chosen on your computer to back up. Okay. Um, and how much is that license? Uh, that's free. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah, it's free. It's a free software. So um, you're saying that if I have 25 users in my mm -hmm. office, yeah. they can all use the app, your guys' app, to back everything up to the yes. to your NAS system yep. without a cost. Without a cost. Wow, yeah. that's very nice. That's a very good, very good feature. You can schedule it and stuff like that. Whenever you can you schedule want. it any time of day you want. Mm -hmm. um, and one of the proprietary uh, functions that we have on that software mm -hmm. is called Mission Mode, which is if your internet dies, uh, let's say randomly, yep. maybe short circuit or whatever, mm -hmm. um, Mission Mode will continue to try to do your backup until it actually connects to your NAS. Wow. So you don't have to worry, if, let's say you're out for a vacation and mm -hmm. uh, one month later you come back and you have nothing saved, nothing got Yeah, you have power outage. Power outage or anything, yeah. Wow. Um, Mission Mode will continually try to backup until once it connects, mm -hmm. it'll continue the backup. Wow, that's yeah. great. That is fantastic news. So, David, is there anything else you want to touch base um, yes. regarding your systems? Okay, so there's another feature that's actually uh, new to us. It's mm -hmm. called uh, a Sue Store Easy Sync. And okay. this is this pretty much turns your NAS into a cloud, kind of like Dropbox. Mm -hmm. So, anything you've updated on your computer automatically gets synced right away to your NAS. Oh, and wow. not only that, you also have history. Um, and so, every time you say, let's just say, a Google Doc, you saved it once, uh, you've edited something, it automatically syncs to your, your NAS. Right. Um, and let's just say the next time you edit it, you save it, but you messed up. Mm -hmm. Actually, the NAS will remember what history versions you have. Oh, so and you can go back, there, there's versioning wow. to it. And so that's our newest feature, um, mm -hmm. and that's in our ADM 3.2. Junior firmware, that's fantastic. Uh, and is that compatible with all of your NAS systems? All our NAS systems. Oh, wow, that's really yeah. cool. I mean, that's great for people you know, in offices that are mm -hmm. backing stuff up, students for the homework, they're yeah. constantly editing, right. and then storing things. So is, it, is that a particular folder you would drag it into? Yeah, so, you, then, can, yeah. You, so you can set up a mm -hmm. specific folder that you want everything inside to be synced, or you can set up multiple folders. Cool. And um, pretty much all the folders will have that function of everything that gets updated will get synced straight to your NAS, and it'll create versions of the, the okay. files that you update. So David, so if I'm working, mm -hmm. let's say I'm working on my laptop, and all of a sudden I get, you know, I get one of these ransomware, mm -hmm. um, you know, um, viruses, it locks up my computer and all that stuff. Everything's going to be on, on this NAS. Everything's on the NAS, and your NAS is safe. To the last version that I... Until the last version, yes. Uh, and then the versions before that. Right. So I could just get this wiped out, mm -hmm. cleaned out, and then then I can just put everything back. Yes. Wow. That's awesome. So David, tell me, um, to get a, a, a NAS system like this, what is someone going to spend? What are we looking at spending? All right, so this model is 359 MSRP. Okay. We also have a smaller version, just two bays, in case you don't need that much storage, and then that's 259. Yeah. Awesome. That's a really good deal. All right, and I have a quick question. So what happens sure. if something fails inside the hard drive, inside our NAS? Well, that's a really good question. Now, the Iron Wolf Pro system, mm -hmm. it actually comes with two years of recovery service. 
um, for, for free. It actually comes for free. What does that even mean? So what happens is if the disc fails, mm -hmm. you just ship it over to us, mm -hmm. um, ship it over to our recovery center, and um, this one's based in Oklahoma, and ship it to us. Uh, we'll recover this information for you, and then we'll send you a link to download it, or we'll send you the actual disc back, a disc back with the data in it as well. Either or, or both, whichever. I mean, if you need it, it's time sensitive, we'll get it back to you. That takes about 10 days. Wow. Yep, yeah, and it's our own, it's our own uh, recovery service. We've been doing it for, for years and years. Um, it's not outsourced. We actually do everything ourselves uh, in-house. So, um, and another point is, is as we're talking about recovery and, and the health of a, of a NASDRAC, is we have the um, uh, IHM, which is the, the health management system, mm. okay? Mm. And what we do is having the ability to work with the asset store, NAS, and then being able to access the health of the drive. So you can see everything on the yeah. drive. So you make sure it's running healthy, uh, every sector, everything is running nice and smooth. So with the health management tool uh, built by Seagate, you can actually see all this and it works really, really well within your system as well. So really, really good feature. That's great. Great time. Great, thanks David. So, great system and it comes included, um, when we talked about the four camera license, mm -hmm. it comes with the backup, mm -hmm. you know, your proprietary backup software, it comes with your Easy easy Connect, yes. cloud, right? Easy Connect easy Cloud, you just lock things in, and everything's included for, for a really good price. Now, good price, now the only thing it doesn't come with is a hard drive, and this is where we come in, okay? Um, uh, here at Seagate, we've developed the Iron Wolf NAS drive, and this NAS drive, it's very special. It's actually built for NAS systems, like the Asset Store NAS system sitting here. Um, what it is, it's very unique because of the firmware. Okay, it has an agile aware firmware that's built specifically for NAS systems and being able to being able to work within the NAS system environment. Uh, physically, it comes with RV sensors. So there's it's built into the system. And you can't see it, but it has two RV sensors in here that helps balance out the um, um, the NAS system. Because what happens is when you have one hard drive you don't have a lot of vibration, right? You're just using it. But what happens when you have multiple NAS systems and it heats up, it's, they're, they're vibrating and gyrating? The actual rotational vibration um, uh, components that are on there will help control that vibration and also help it out uh, with noise levels and things like that. So um, we highly recommend um, when using a NAS system, use uh, uh, the Iron Wolf NAS drive and the Iron Wolf Pro NAS drive because, again, they're built specifically just for NAS systems, right. similar to this one. So, so again, David, thank you very much for your time. A great system, um, and again, it, it complements very well with uh, some great hard drives from Seagate. Uh, David, um, yeah, thank you very much for talking. Thank you so much. Thanks.